French Army is evaluating Pinnaka multi-barrel rocket launcher systems for its requirements. Russia's Rostec Corporation has unveiled an updated line of engines of the AL-31FN family, for SU-27 and SU-30 with 6,000 hours of service life, which is three times that of the older AL-31 engine. Barut Dynamics Limited and Rosborone Export have signed a MOU for cooperation on Pantsir air defense missile gun system. Indian Air Force Chief has said, that a case for procurement of 66 Prachon for Air Force and 90 Prachon for the Indian Army is under progress. Mazagin Dock Ship Builders is building a very long dry dock with an investment of 5,000 crore rupees, that will double its shipbuilding capacity. National Aerospace Laboratories is working on active radar cross-section reduction technology for AMCA. Hal Chief has said, that the company expects to wrap up negotiations of F-414 deal, and finalize the contract by mid-2025. Russia has announced that its S-70 stealth unmanned aerial combat vehicle costs about $15 million, similar to an older F-16 fighter jet. The Defense Ministry has sought a green nod to build additional ammunition storage capacity in Ladakh, for enhancing ammunition availability during operational deployment of military units. The Indian Army has initiated discussions with several key Indian UAV manufacturers, to develop UAVs capable of transporting two tons of cargo. The armies of India and Australia held the opening ceremony of third edition of Exercise Australian 2024 Joint Military Exercise at the Foreign Training Node in Pune. National Aerospace Laboratories has initiated the evaluation of control laws for the Tejas Mark II aircraft, marking a crucial step in its developmental progress. The Tejas Mark II features numerous enhancements, and these flight control laws are algorithms, that are essential for enabling precise maneuverability and optimal stability across various flight phases. The Aeronautical Development Agency has received enthusiastic responses from 19 private sector companies regarding its tender for the manufacturing of aircraft structural assemblies for the upcoming Tejas Mark II TED-BF and AMCA programs. With combined orders of nearly 400 units anticipated over the next two decades, the stakes are high, and the participation of private players will be pivotal. Amid the delay in F-404 engines, a debate has started that can the 98 kN F-414 engine replace the 84 kN F-404 engine on the Tejas Mark 1A fighters. Both the F-404 and F-414 engines measure 154 inches in length, but the F-404 engine has a maximum fan diameter of around 35 inches, while the F-414 has a slightly larger fan diameter of approximately 35.5 inches. The difference in fan diameter is minimal, and the Tejas Mark 1A's airframe will require slight adjustments in the engine housing and cooling systems. The enhanced thrust of the F-414 will allow the Tejas Mark 1A to achieve greater combat effectiveness by carrying more ordnance or fuel. Today's Top 3 Comments Oh, my God.